Also is lining up. They're off. This is the betdirectpoker.com Hunter's Steeplechase taking a total of 22 fences, but a long run before they leave the ground for the first time. First to fences over in the back straight, and it's Family Business who makes the early running from Go White Lightning, who's in second place. Paddy for Paddy is uh, prominent with Supreme Glory, also well up with the pace. Camden Carrig not too far away towards the outside of runners as they uh, head away down the far side, and then comes Maximize just in behind that group, looking back to the rear in the early stages. And uh, the back marker is Maggie's brother, also Spires Peace in the rear division as they head towards the first fence as they make the run out towards the far side of the course. And Go White Lightning has moved into the lead narrowly from Family Business with four lengths back to Paddy for Paddy in third as they take the first fence. They're followed by Camden Carried, leap from Maximize that one passed to Supreme Glory in the air as they took the first in the back straight and on towards the first open ditch. Family Business lands alongside Go White Lightning as they all stream over that one safely. Vinny Boy is uh, towards the rear with a short run towards the third fence, which the two leaders have negotiated safely. And again, they're all over it safely, although Vinny Boy jumping rather slowly at the back of the field. On towards the fence number four as they continue down the far side. Family Business leads from Go White Lightning in second. Paddy for Paddy is back in third within fourth place. The dual course winner, Camden Carrick. These are being followed three lengths away by Maximize, who races towards the inside with two more fences to take over in the back straight. Go White Lightning, non too fluent at that fence. No retreats racing mid-division at this stage with also in the midfield Stand Easy. And Vinnie Boy is uh, still the back marker as they take the last fence over on the far side where... Again, Go White Lightning was rather slow. A mistake there by Stand Easy. Hit that fence very hard indeed. And uh, they head now towards the end of the back straight. And they're getting well strung out with a good 25 lengths between first and last. And they're still taken along by Family Business. And although he's made a couple of sketchy jumps on the far side, Go White Lightning is still a handy second. Paddy for Paddy attracts them in third place. Three lengths to maximize with the cheek pieces. Then comes Camden Carrig. No retreat. Is next in the field, back in sixth. And then a further break of five lengths back to Supreme Glory as they begin the run into the home straight on this, the first circuit. And at the back of the field, Vinnie Boyd, some way detached, along with Maggie's brother. They're preceded by Stand Easy and also in the rear group, Father Mansfield. But over the first in the straight, the two leaders landed as one. Stand Easy, again, far from fluent to that fence as Go White Lightning shares the lead as they come towards an open ditch with family business and Camden Carrig, who's closer now in third as Go White Lightning made another error. They're tracked a further two lengths away by Paddy for Paddy and then comes Maximize as they head towards the middle one of the five in the home straight. Family business from Camden Carrig, who has jumped through to take second place and uh, we had a faller uh, back in the field of Spires Peace who came down when in midfield. So on towards the uh, next fence, this is a plain one, and there Go White Lightning again hit the fence quite hard, but uh, still in the leading bunch, although the leading group of six have bunched up as they come to take this fence in front of the stands. Family business from the fluent jumping Camden Carrig in second place, so steady progress for no retreat going third ahead of Go White Lightning. Paddy for Paddy remains prominent, as does Maximize, and then there's six lengths to Supreme Glory, who's followed a further length and a half away by Father Mansfield. Vinny Boy has improved a place or two, but it's still some 15 lengths off the lead. Stand Easy is now last but one. The back marker continues to be Maggie's brother. So making the run at the uh, bottom end of the course, they past the halfway stage in this betdirectpoker.com Hunter's steeplechase. And the leader continues to be Family business, who's made just about all so far under Julian Pritchard, leads by three lengths. No retreat has improved to go second. Camden Carrig in third. And then comes Go White Lightning in fourth place, followed closely by Paddy for Paddy in fifth. A break of three lengths to Maximize, and then 12 lengths to Supreme Glory, who's followed uh, further back by Father Mansfield. Father Mansfield in turn three lengths ahead of Vinnie Boy Stand Easy. And the back marker continues to be Maggie's brother. Going towards the first fence over on the far side, Family Business has increased the lead, gone five lengths clear 
as they take that fence, the first in the back straight. Now they face an open ditch. No retreats in second. Paddy for Paddy's in third. Camden Carrick loses his place quickly as the leaders jump the open ditch. And it's uh, going to be past Camden Carrick for fourth very shortly by Maximize. Go White Lightning has stopped very quickly and drops back through the field as the leaders stream over a plain fence on the far side of the course. And they go now towards a fence that is eighth from home. So they're racing then towards the eighth last, and it's family business by three lengths from no retreat and four lengths to Paddy for Paddy, four lengths then to Maximize, and five lengths behind that one then races Camden Carrick as they make the run then towards the uh, next on the far side of the course, and this is seven from the finish. Family business leads from no retreat, Paddy for Paddy, and Maximize, they're drawing away from Camden Carrick's supreme glory, and then a further three lengths behind that one is Vinnie Boy, and... They're heading then towards the last fence over on the far side where Family Business once again took off in front and landed ahead of no retreat. Paddy for Paddy is five lengths away and pushed along. Maximize is back in fourth place and this leading group then a long way clear of Camden Carrick, Supreme Glory and then a big gap back to Father Mansfield as they swing out of the back straight and they have another five fences to take when they turn for home. Well, a brave front-running effort from family business here. He's made just about all so far, but he's being tracked closely now by no retreat in second place as they make the turn into the home straight, just about half a mile out. Paddy for Paddy has got six lengths to find on the front two. Paddy for Paddy, in turn, is well clear of the fourth horse, Maximize, as they race then towards five out. Family business from no retreat in second. Paddy for Paddy urged along to try and close in third. Five from home. Family business takes it well from no retreat. Then Paddy for Paddy, and there some six lengths clear of Maximize, who's back in fourth place as they race then to the final ditch. This is four from home, and coming towards it, it'll be the leader once again. Family business over safely. Paddy for Paddy coming through now to dispute second place with no retreat. They're still well clear of Maximize as family business races towards three out. Still with a clear lead, five lengths ahead of Paddy for Paddy, who touches down in second, no retreat at the one pace, back in third, and then there's a good set, 12 lengths back to Maximize. Now they're racing towards two from the finish, family business over safely, only four lengths clear of Paddy for Paddy, and then comes no retreat. Now they're racing towards the final fence, family business trying to make every yard, four lengths clear, Paddy for Paddy second, no retreat third at the last, family business over safely, three lengths then back to uh, Paddy for Paddy in second as family business heads up towards the line, family business has made every yard, Paddy for Paddy staying on under pressure in second but can't bridge the gap any further and family business makes just about all to score, family business beats Paddy for Paddy, no retreat was third and then came Maximize back in fourth. First, number seven. Second, number four. Third, number one. And the fourth placed horse, number 11. The full result of our sixth race of the card, the BetDirectPoker.com Hunter Steeplechase. First, number seven, Family Business. Second, number four, Paddy for Paddy. Third, number one, No Retreat. And the fourth placed horse, number 11, Maximize. Now they're racing towards two from the finish. Family business over safely. Only four lengths clear of Paddy for Paddy. And then comes no retreat. Now they're racing towards the final fence. Family business trying to make every yard. Four lengths clear. Paddy for Paddy second. No retreat third at the last. Family business over safely. Three lengths then back to uh, Paddy for Paddy in second. As family business heads up towards the line. Family business has made every yard. Paddy for Paddy staying on under pressure in second. But can't bridge the gap any further and Family Business makes just about all to score. Family Business beats Paddy for Paddy, no retreat was third, and then came Maximize back in fourth. <laughs> 